Athletes have been speaking up against racial inequality here in Iowa for decades. Former Iowa State Representative Wayne Ford is also a former Drake Bulldog football player. Scott Reister shares his powerful perspective. As one of only a dozen black football players on his team at Drake in the early 70s, Wayne Ford felt respect. The football community set the tone. Just as his white and black friends that served in Vietnam relied on each other in the war, his black and white teammates had a similar mentality. And we had to play as a team and race was not an issue because in Vietnam, I mean, it, it could get you killed if you could not work together. So that kind of camaraderie helped me in the 60s and it helped me when I got to Drake. Now, when we get back to America or when I leave these communities, it's business as usual. Black people are treated like second citizens. But as athletes, even you can see today, black and white athletes have a unique bond. Athletes of his era were just as socially active as they are now. Muhammad Ali said, I'm not going to fight. It went to the Supreme Court. So that was a big issue. And the biggest athletes in the world said we support him and nothing happened to them. I mean, they didn't get fined. As a state representative, there were times he was the only black legislator and spread his message of equality. He enlisted legends, Jim Brown, Bill Russell, and more. All we want is one thing. If a white person can look in the mirror and treat them, treat a black person, get ready for this, Scott, the same way they treat themselves. Because the problems are not going nowhere until white people see black people as equals. Are we any closer now to that day we're closer now, Scott. Scott, this brings tears to my eyes. I just got my first grandchild, Faith, and I'm so happy because her world would be much different than mine. We ain't never seen this many white people upset. Everybody cares now. Sports equal the playing field. Having that carryover is the dream. You, you see me and you hear me and, and you clap for me. Remove the sports. The next time you see me, look at me as an equal. Forget if I can play ball. Look at me as an equal, and that will change the course of history in this country.